They can't ride with me, I'm on a tidal wave So I been heating up like a microwave Ain't no beef for free, but you gotta pay Give a dick, I ain't got time to compensate They ain't give me a map, had to find a way Tryna beat up a pussy all type of ways They can't better smoke, make the ops hibernate Niggas bitches, so I tend to isolate Know that I'm stiff like a brick and I drip like some paint They can't ride them all way, this is tsunami I got the Glock on my hip and do shit that they can't I take drugs and I get out of my body Can't break the weed, it's too sticky I do a fuck nigga like Ricky Hit him with a big shot, he know that the ops wanna murder me That's why I keep a Glock 33, I caught a six shot I got some weed in my way, so Yo, what is up YouTube? We are back with another video And another build And when I tell you This build is different when I tell you this build is different, I want you to listen to me when I say that. And I want you to believe me when I say that this build is different. This is what I like to call him. Oh my gosh, I just made this build, y'all. Them clips, them clips in the beginning was fresh out the lab, fresh out the builder. I just made this build yesterday. Not even all my badges, not fully upgraded. Hooping like that, yes, fresh out the builder, I promise you that. All right. So we going point guard. Okay, point guard, 6'3", 189 pounds. Okay, 6'8", wingspan. All right. For the close shot, we putting that at 51. Okay. Not, nothing crazy. Nothing crazy, all right. Driving layup, we are going to put the driving layup at 75. We're going to put the driving layup at 75. And that will get you Giant Slayer goal. Pro touch goal. Okay, for the driving dunk, we are putting the driving dunk on a 87. Yes, we are putting the driving dunk on a 87. Okay. Now, uh, I feel like this is, this is really good. Um, I feel like it's really good. I feel like if you go to OD on it, I know I know a lot of people want that 94 drive dunk. I know 94 drive dunk is meta right now, but hear me out. You know, 87 is valid. But if you want to get that 94, you're going to have to sacrifice, like, probably all your defense. Like, you're going to have no defense. And I don't like a build that's just a complete liability. I don't like a build that's a complete liability on defense. I want to be able to get some stops, and we're going to get to that. All right. Okay. So that's that. That's for the finishing. All right. And as well, I want to show y'all. So um, you are going to be able to get posterizer silver. But once I upgrade my vertical, you're going to be able to get posterizer silver. You're going to have slithery silver, precision silver, bunny gold, Whistle, Aerial Wizard, like Spin Cycle, Hoff, Two Step Hoff, like I'm telling you, bro, that that 87 is trim, like it's trim, like it's something different for real. All right, boom. So for the mid range, we are going 77 for the mid range. We are going 77 for the mid range, and we are going 92 for the three pointer. On my other guy build, I went. 96 on my three point on my other guard build that I have my three point shot hunter and when I tell you that this 92 three point feels the exact same this 92 is that sweet spot when I tell you this 92 three point is so crispy go 92 on the three point I'm telling you okay for the free throw we are going 80 because I like to play pro am and rec this is why I put my free throw up if you do not play pro am or rec do not worry about your free throw. Simple as that. <laughs> as simple as that. Don't worry about it. Don't touch it. Say, it. put them points somewhere else. If you, the few points that you have, put them somewhere else, okay? For the pass accuracy, we are not throwing loogies. We are not throwing spitballs. We are going 85 on the pass accuracy. We are throwing lasers. We ain't throwing steezies. We throwing straight lasers. Okay, we are going 85 on the pass accuracy, okay? And that's going to get you that needle threader, silver, and that special delivery goal, which are some trim, some very essential passing badges that will have you 
acting right. I know some of y'all might want to get that bell out. Um, you can always tweak this. You feel me? This is just a template for y'all. This is just a template for y'all. And if there's anything y'all want to change, change. This is just my suggestion. This is just what I'm doing. I'm showing y'all my build. I'm playing with. If you want to change it, tweak it and change it. Simple. All right. For the ball handle, we're going 93 on the ball handle. Now I'm going to tell you we're going 93 on that ball handle instead of 92. The 92, well, you definitely want to be at 92 because it's going to um, it's going to unlock the essential dribble moves that you want to put on. It's going to unlock a lot of the dribble moves that you are going to want to equip. Um, but we went up to 93. The Killer Combos Gold and the Ankle Breaker Hawk, which are very good badges if y'all seen in the beginning. I'm getting Ankle Breakers crazy. You feel me? So go up to that 93 instead of 92. To get that gold killer combos and that hall of fame angle breaker I'm telling you it's gonna be acting different okay speed with ball you already know 90 on the speed with ball 90 on the speed with ball if you don't go 90 on the speed with ball you are a certified bot guard and your wiggles will not be at full capacity this 90 speed with ball will unlock that Kyrie dribble style which is different, the best dribble style in the game, okay? So as a little guard, please go 90 speed with ball to get that Kyrie dribble style. This dribble style will make you different. I'm telling you, go to 90 speed with ball. My first build, I made the mistake and was thinking this was 2K23 and I went low on my speed with ball. Worst mistake ever, okay? Avoid that mistake and go 90 speed with ball to get that Kyrie dribble style. Trust me. Okay? So, boom. That's it for the playmaking, y'all. For the interior defense, we are going to bump that up to 63. Now, when I tell y'all I am able to get stops in the paint with a 63 interior defense. Okay, a lot of people make this build and go no defense, but not me. I don't want to be a liability on defense. Not a complete liability. I want to be able to get a stop if needed. If the game is in, in on the watch, if the game is on the line, and I just got to get that one stop, I want to be able to get it. I can't be a complete liability, okay? This is why I always put a some defense on my build. I suggest I always put some defense, okay? So, boom. Um, Cause I know a lot of people will probably go 89 on the pass sack. You don't like a lot more stuff, but I just went 85 so I can get some defense. Okay, cause you need a little bit of defense just to get those clutch stops for your team when they need it. Okay, and for the perimeter, we went 62 on the perimeter. Okay, we went 62 on the perimeter. Like I said just to be able to stay in front so I'm not on ice. Okay, I don't want to be sliding all around the court. So we got to put that perimeter up to a decent, a decent amount, you feel me? So we, we put that perimeter on 62. Block, okay, y'all, this is one thing. Block, 64, max that block out. Max that block out, okay? When I tell you that this block you are going to be able to get those clutch stops. It's minimum, but it be it be there when you need it. Like it be there when you need it. Like as a little guard, you wanna have a little defense. You don't want somebody to think they could just rim run on you the whole game and just, you know, backdoor you all game. You wanna have some defense where you can show them not to play with you. Where you can show them not to play with you. For the speed, we went 86. You know we went. We know we had to go 86 speed to get the gold speed booster. All right, we went 83 on the acceleration. Okay, we went 83 on 86 on the speed, 83 on the acceleration. Okay, for the strength. One thing I also didn't like on my other build. I feel like locks could bump me too much and get way too jiggy with me. We put our strength up to 60. 
We put our strength up to 60 to get the physical handles, at least on bronze. Okay, I feel like this is something a lot of guards don't do. But I feel like this is comp. This is comp. And if you can get it to 63, lift your weight up a little bit, and you can get it to 63 and you sacrifice something. Say you say you drop your pass accuracy and you, you can get it to silver physical handles. Do it. Do it. This is needed. I feel like this is needed and it's something that you need on your guard because the locks get too bumpy. If you have no strength, that lock going to get way too bumpy on you. Okay? For vertical, we went 75 on the vertical. This is so you're able to get those pro contact dunks. Okay? 75 vertical. This is really good on a little guard. That 75 vertical is going to have you jumping out the gym. And this is also going to unlock that silver posterizer in the gold aerial wizard. And then for the rest, we maxed out. What did I do wrong? What am I doing wrong? Oh, the mid range went up to 78 for some reason. Okay, 99 on the stam. Okay, um, you're gonna have a few extra points when you do that. Bronze workhorse. I did not do that. Um, I just went my last two on defensive rebound. So yeah, no, don't do that. Put it on. Put your last two points that you have on your interior defense to get the bronze workhorse. I would suggest you do that. Yes, y'all, but that is the build. Y'all, this is the build, okay? Copy these numbers, you feel me? Put, put these stats in if you want to be a demon, okay? Put these numbers in if you wanna be a demon and also get the crispy name. Floor space and slasher. Don't play, man. Don't play. Hey, them slashing playmaking builds is taking over 2K. Go, go get you one. Go, go. Get, you better, you better get you one of these. <laughs> we out, man. <laughs> You can hear it outside, we ain't smoking on ten of G. We keep a chop in the back of the ride like a kid when we slide. I ain't worried about enemies. My double cup helped me kill the pain. Me and my brother, we built the same. We got some symmetry. Better go listen to instantly. Told you, fuck niggas, I've been a G. Where I came up was way differently. Burning this track, got me feeling like Timothy. Not chasing hoes, I ain't.